Hello all. In this video, we're going to talk about plane of smoke trials. So this is, how can I phrase this nicely? This is probably one of the bigger bottlenecks when this expansion was live. These trials, um, they're kind of a pain in the butt, uh, just to put it mildly. It, it's easier now because you know levels and everything but the mechanics and things like that it it definitely could get frustrating and um a lot of players now still do not have savior done for those reasons just because of the mechanics or the needed group setup so i'm not gonna do them all in this video mainly because i can't like um i do need some real people to help me do some of them um what we will do and this is one that a lot of people struggle with even with a lot of people is the wending ways trial the appointment required don't trip and just passing through so let's talk about it wending ways is the northeast one once you zone in and basically with this one is there's going to be four different um, genies that you need to kill in a specific order. Which order is determined by the smoke that you see, like the auras that you see. And I'll explain that in a moment. So getting to the achievements. And basically with this one, you're jumping around from teleport to teleport. So if you like uh, goods maps, and you'll see here, this port will take you to fire water and then so forth. You just follow the map on whichever one you need to go. So appointment required. Complete the mission without entering the room of the ambassador out of order. So don't screw up, like read the, like the notices so you go to the correct room. Don't trip. So basically when you're teleporting, you don't fall into the center. This is one that super frustrating because if you're lagging or you have some sort of latency issues or just human error, you fail it and nobody gets it. Kind of sucks. And then passing through, um, it's just doing it correctly, like the reset thing. So another thing about this smoke trials in general it locks on requests so if you notice to have the, i have the tunes that i'm helping run through so they have to be in the group at the start then you could drop them for this purpose i'm going to keep dc uh, which is a wizard in the group and run him along with us Big thing here is nothing sees in Viz. So when you're traveling between the ambassadors, as long as you're in Viz, you're good. You're you're golden. So. Okay. So how do you determine where to go? You'll see once we step in, the auras will start. And then you want to look around the room and see which is the dominant one. If you need, you know, count, but it looks like fire. Fire is the main one. If you're playing multiple tunes, uh, do not auto follow. Auto follow bad. All right, so fire, and you see, you wait. You follow this one? What the hell? Hmm, I took this off for whatever reason. Anyway, that's gonna die. Go here, fire. And then this guy. If it's the incorrect one, when you move into the room, it will boot you. 
Okay, so just for the sake of saving time in the video, since I'm playing four tunes and I'm going to run them, I'm going to pause the video, get all the tunes there, and then continue. So be right back. Okay, so in this room, this fire guy is pretty much tank and spank, but you'll notice like these three um, platform things or whatever. His health will lock at a certain point. So when it locks, just move it to the next one. All right, so here we go. These things have a ton of hit points. Um, I'm not good enough to play four characters correctly. So the wizard, you see, he's just auto filing and that's about it. So the reason why I have the wizard in the group is actually I'm going to evac um, after this dies. So I don't need to worry about running back to the start position or anything like that. So that this way the don't trip achievement is that much easier. Okay, health is locked. Move it to the next. I'll show lock soon. Locked. Okay, so I said I was going to evac, but this one thing is if it's water next. So we're going to take a peek on the side. No, it looks like it's air. See how there's more air ducts? So the next one's air. Alright, so. Wizard. Wizard's going to evac us so you don't risk falling off.
So we determine it's air. Air is the second portal on the left. So you go up here. Here you'll see it's marked air. And there you go. So you go in, nothing happens. Okay, so same deal. I'm going to pause the video, run the tunes here, and then continue. All right. Okay, back. So here we go. This one is a straight tank and spank. It does have high resist, so uh, melee do better on this one. So biggest thing is you don't need to rush. There's no time thing. So if you don't happen to have a wizard or a druid to evac, you could, in theory, gate out and then run back. Maybe set a campfire outside or something like that. And that works also. Okay, going to evac us. So now it's water or earth left. Hmm. That's peculiar. Anyway, we'll kill it. Okay, looks like hmm. water, right? There's definitely more water than anything else. Okay, so it's basically towards where our fire was. So take the first portal on the left. Here's fire. Take the next one, see how it's with water. Follow this, it's linear. See how it's with water. Okay, see, go in, it's safe. All right, pausing the video, I'll be right back. Okay. Here we go, so just tank and spank.
So you can imagine, um, decently geared and current, you know, with current raid stuff, and you see how much damage it takes. So when it was live, not so much fun. Okay, evac us. One thing to note also about the Dome Trip, when this first came out, there was so much uh, uproar about it, it taking forever and not knowing if you failed or not. So they actually added an emote where it says someone fell. So you know early on if you uh, did it or not. So it's a good thing. Okay, so by you know default, the last one is going to be Earth, which is going to be the portal to the right. It says Earth. Be right back in a pause video running the guys over. Okay, here we go. So this splits into two small ones. Um, basically, kill them then. So one thing, and I've seen it work both ways, so I'm not 100% positive how it works, but this third one just passing through, I've seen you get it just by winning it and no one doing it, or you don't. I don't know of the consistency, basically. So when we beat this, if we get it, great. If not, then there's like this little portal uh, towards the end when you bounce around and that's what you gotta go through but we'll see like i've done this the same exact way and sometimes i get the achievement and sometimes I don't but regardless though the hardest thing is the don't trip the other one you know uh, can be done easily All right. Wizards can evac us and basically we open the chest and that should be it. People out of zone, if you got them in the task, will get credit. So no issues there. And okay, there we go. So you got all three. So that's it for Wending Ways, the savior achievements, the easiest slash best way that I know how to do it. All right, all. Thanks, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.